Good morning, I'm Mel. And I'm Jen, and we are the Mommy MacGyvers. We're real moms bringing you real tips. Yes. And today <laughs> is the best hot fudge ever. ever. <laughs> Sit down, you're not gonna miss this. Get your pen so you can write down the website and get the recipe. It's, yes. It will change your life. Yes, Post. we are diving right in. So I'm gonna show you what we have going on already in the pan. This is two sticks of butter and four squares of unsweet dark chocolate over a double boiler, which is just water boiling in the bottom over the top of another pan. So I wanna show you that that's all stirred together. And once that is all melted, you'll start adding your alternate sugars. And we have white sugar and brown sugar. So I'm gonna start doing this. And you stir it in just little by little by little. And this will take a while. It probably takes about 45 minutes yes. to an hour to just alternate sugars and let it dissolve. And Mel came over to my house earlier this week and it was wonderful. We yes. just had some hot coffee or if you yes. did it later on, you could have a little glass of wine and yes. just have good girl chat time. Um, the reason why I think this is so amazing is because you can make a bazillion Christmas gifts for like 10 bucks or yes. less. Yes. It's Yep. It's when ridiculous. we added it up, it, I made 16 jars for $6. So it's, it's actually a fantastic teacher gift. It's a really great holiday gift. Because, just, yeah, go ahead. For those people in your life that you're just not sure you want to get a little something for, but you're not sure what. So. Yes, and with school, you do. You want to get a gift for the nurse and the librarian right. and the principal and everyone. And before right. you know it, you need all these gifts. And it's just too expensive. So I'm going to tell so. you a couple of really important tips. So once you've added all the sugars together and they've all dissolved, it's going to fall apart. And I'm going to show you a picture of what it looks like. It gets really chunky and it looks disgusting and you're going to think you ruined it. However, hang on tight, keep stirring, add in the can of evaporated milk slowly and stir that in. And now I'm going to show you a picture of how delicious it looks when you get done doing that part. Oh, it's and all it looks creamy, perfect. beautiful. So it's dark chocolate amazingness and then you package it up to give as mm -hmm. gifts. You know, I got these jars at Walmart. I think there were a dozen for $7, like so awesome. inexpensive. Just pour it in the jars and then have fun decorating. I just yes. went through my ribbons and found some little scrapbook um, holiday stickers and just decorate it up and have a really good time. And look right. at these cute little labels so people and know that it's homemade. And yes. One more last tip. When you do give this as a gift, you want to give instructions. I usually hand out the recipe with the jar and instructions to just heat the portion that you're going to eat in each individual time, not to heat the whole jar each time because it will kind of break it apart. But that's our most amazing hot fudge ever recipe. So don't forget, go on to Casa.com and click on the Casa Morning blog and the full recipe will be there. Yes. And we hope you enjoy having as much fun making it as we did. Yes. And your teachers are going to think you are amazing. Yes. So go make it. Have a great week, everybody. Thank you for watching. Thank you, ladies. This is the fudge that they made. Absolutely yummy. I just had some right now. And oh, you just stop God. Eating it's, product. it's yeah, only just, Monday. There's a lot of food to come. A little bit. All right. Good. Wow. Uh, <laughs> sugar <laughs> shock. <laughs> great job, ladies. Let's get to the question. That's right. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Wow. Get